Hi guys, Iron Cameraman here. This is the second official leak of part one of episode 73, and as soon as I saw it, at first I thought Defuck Boom just showed a friend of the same ski beady toilet that died in episode 49 because it looks a lot like him. However, it turns out that's not all we're going to talk about today. If you pay attention to the top left corner, you can see the caption, you have no idea what's coming. And on the right side of one of the buildings, the number 74 is written six times. As we remember, this same number was also in other leaks before the release of episode 72. Dafuk has already said in interviews that both 73 and 74 episodes will be very hot. However, why exactly is this number written six times? And could it mean something? Today, I will break it down for you. Also, if you look to the left of the building, you can see a secret agent. Everything I have listed is just from one leak. Don't forget, we have a previous one as well. I'll try to find all the connections and details for you to see what to expect in episode 73. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe to the channel and put like. If we get over 5,000 likes, I'll be very happy. Anyway, here we go. Let's start with the most important thing. Boom decided to show us a new character in the foreground. Other than having two circular saws on his hands and a round thing on his toilet reminiscent of Astro Toilets, he has no other important details. So let's better discuss the red lines. It's not hard to guess that the agents are shooting at him and trying to kill him. Judging by the fact that they are exactly red lines and also taking into account that the shots happen from above, it becomes clear that the agents not only have guns with red laser, but also jetpacks to fly and simultaneously cause damage from the air. It's likely that we'll see two large cameramen in this episode, similar to what we saw, for example, in the fight with Skibidi Scientist in Episode 70, Part 3. If that's the case, it's likely that part of the squad from Episode 70 has already reached their destination. Let me remind you that according to all of Boom's answers, this episode will not take place near the Alpha Hills lab, but somewhere remote. After Episode 72, it becomes clear that this remote location may be the last backup location for the Skibidi toilets where G-Man flew away, and the Titans, as we recall, followed him. Interestingly, the leak says, you have no idea what's coming. I thought for a long time what that could mean, and came to the conclusion that this phrase most likely refers us to episode 74, not 73. Moreover, as I said, in addition to episode 74, there will also be an event in episode 80 of the same magnitude that I mentioned in the video about the possible return of Plunger or other legendary characters. However, that doesn't mean that Dafuk Boom won't surprise us in this episode, since it seems that since the secret agent will be present in the new episode, the appearance of his assistants becomes very likely. Personally, I'm expecting the appearance of Red Cameraman, who came to life at the end of episode 70, but has yet to appear in the series. Since we have already seen the secret character three times in different places, I believe that the appearance of Simp Cameraman, or the same Red Cameraman, is the most likely event in the 73rd or 74th episodes. Keep in mind that episode 73 will be split into two parts. So everything I'm currently speculating could happen in the second half of the episode rather than the first. Besides the fact that we will be shown fights between regular agents, we know from the first leak that G-Man will also be there to see the Titans. Why Titans specifically, I've already explained in previous videos. It seems to me that Dafuk won't be in a hurry to show us the Astro Toilets again. I think it will happen in part two of episode 73 or in episode 74. As previous episodes usually show, if a character is badly damaged, they take a long time to recover before coming back for revenge. My thought is that even if Dafuk Boom shows Astro Toilets in episode 73, it probably won't be in the form of a fight with G-Man or the Titans. Besides all this, there's another circular saw here on the bottom right of the leak. But since it is too low down, we can conclude that this character is already dead. By the way, when I read your comments in the YouTube community, where I showed you this leak, many people started to write for some reason that this is the unfinished last project of the scientist who is in the containers. But as I see it, it's just a strong character with circular saws. And there's no way it could be the scientist's project. Perhaps some people thought so, since his legs look like those of a scientist. However, in my opinion, the scientist's latest project 
is such a strong phenomenon that it will drastically shift the entire balance of power in the series. Let me remind you that Boom never immediately shows the most important thing in his leaks. Even before episode 67, he didn't show what the improved TV Man Titan looks like in the leaks until the end, and only showed the Troll leak, which I think you all remember, as it's very memorable. Judging from all these details, G-Man will still be able to reach his destination in episode 73, but then it turns out that the regular agents with big cameramen with red guns have already gotten there before him. This explains why the TV man Titan was so sure in episode 72 that he wouldn't be able to escape this time. And I'll even say more. Besides that famous line in episode 72, he also said in an additional scene in season 23 that he knew where he flew off to. Perhaps these agents were already in the right location beforehand and told TV man Titan about the possible terrain where g man squad was headed. On the one hand, this is very good news for the Alliance. But on the other hand, we should not forget how cunning G-Man is. After all, the Titans will meet him in his own location, where he can anticipate such an outcome and prepare himself by planning a plan of action for such an eventuality. Well, I have already told you many times about Cameraman Titan's hand, and even, as you remember, with the help of my friend, I created this frame to show you how it can happen approximately. I hope the cameraman Titan is aware of G-Man's ability to infect body parts so that he doesn't fall into that trap like the Astro Toilet. This ends up being one of the most interesting leaks in recent memory. I really love it when Dafuk Boom hides some secrets and details in a leak. After all, agree, it is much more interesting than the usual direct information, which is already in a ready-made form given to the audience. It is for this reason that I like the original Ski Beady Toilet. The atmosphere and vibe of all its phrases and episodes has some kind of magical effect on me. I don't know if I'm the only one with this opinion or not, but I'd love to know your opinion on it. Write in the comments how you feel about the Boom's leaks and what you'd like to see more of in these leaks. By the way, friends, besides this leak, something else interesting happened today. As you know, I showed you my face, and that video already has over 100,000 views in a very small amount of time. I honestly didn't expect you guys to like that video so much, so thank you so much for your support and your likes. While we are waiting for episode 73 to be released, I recommend watching this video for those who haven't watched it yet, because I also showed my room there, besides my face and real voice. And when there will be 1 million subscribers, I will try to make another grand video where I will tell about another secret about me. So subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the release of my other exclusive videos. Bye.